fantastic. All right, now let's do even better than that now, okay? So let's close this down. Let's go back here. And now let's run that damn thing that we just created. So to do that, we go exec. And then again, I'm going to do this. Now I'm learning my lesson, right? So, and uh, that run fn. Exec tickle kit. Uh, file join tickle kit. That goes like that. That goes like that. That goes like that. Okay, so call tickle kit, right? Because tickle kit's a program that is running everything. The interpreter. Run defense what we just saved, that text. And then ampersand is just to uh, run it immediately and so that things work. It's just, okay. So uh, drop that in there. Now let's press Alt F1, okay? Couldn't read, no such file. Oh, again, same damn thing. All right. You know what I'm going to do up here to fix all this whole thing? I'm just going to change directory. That's going to fix everything. I won't have to do the silliness. All right, so Alt F1. And there we go. It's running. It just ran another program. It, oh, what the hell? My, my life is complete. All right, so I'm going to show you this. Okay, check this out. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to change the text background to navy in the foreground to white. Now you see I'm in the program itself. I'm in the goddamn program. I'm not in notepad right now, right? And I'm just going to press Alt F1. And oh my god, it just ran itself, but it's edited now. Okay, I just edited. And watch this now. And now from the, that run, the run that just ran, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to do the same thing, but oh my lord, I'm going to uh, change the colors to, where the hell is the text widget? Oh, of course. Because it's not loading itself, right? It's loading the contents of, okay, okay. Well, that's a little bit of cold water. So um, what I'm going to do here is, uh, do, 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 do. when it loads itself, okay, so instead of loading prog.x, I'm going to make it load. All right, this is just some, don't ask, okay, don't ask. It's the file name of the program that started. Just, just bear with me. Let's just uh, let's just put this to the to the, uh, to the text here. Okay, we don't even need to do that. All right, so I'm gonna drop that in there again. Couldn't open. Oh Lord, no! Don't say that to me, please. Okay, let's erase this. All right, maybe that'll work. Oh, God, it hurts. All right, uh, insert and file get Linux rv v zero. All right, I'm not sure what's happening here, but all right, so we're gonna go puts rv v, puts rv v to, uh, to the console and just return, don't evaluate anything else because obviously things aren't going too well. So, oh, there's no argument vector, eh? Okay, it doesn't actually set the argument vector, oh well. All right, so so what I'm going to do here then is every time it gets called, okay, I will actually have to call with the argument vector. Okay, so if argument vector equals empty, then set the file set loader uh, to frog.x else set loader to lindex arg v zero yeah i know that's really goddamn nasty i know sorry okay oh, it's really off the cuff but there you go all right so uh okay runs it's good of course it runs all right so but now here's the thing, when you actually run it, I'm going to send it the run event again. <laughs> I know, it's gross. Sorry, I'm really sorry. It's just, it's nasty. Life sucks. Okay, so Alt F1. And oh, it's running. And Alt F1 again. And oh, it's running again. So now the runs are calling themselves. If you, The runs are creating new runs. Okay, so let's do that same trick again. But let's make it work this time. Okay, so background navy, foreground white. 
All right, run it. Cool. And now from here, you see it's just loaded it, right? And now let's change the background to pink. Oh my god, pink. Now let's run it again. Oh, that's hardly readable. So let's just foreground black. All right. All right. Oh, that's amazing. All right, so I don't know if you really understand. You probably do. Maybe you don't. I don't know. The point is here, you see, I'm editing now the program in itself, right? This is the program. It's not Notepad anymore, right? I'm actually editing the program here. Yeah, yeah, that's... Why would anyone want to do that? I know. <laughs> that's what I think. All right, pro now what we're going to add in here, okay? So as you see, it's, it's just making a bunch of... It's just littering the whole world with files. All right, so, Brock, what we're going to do here is run yourself. So... Uh, reload self. This is this is basically the end. Don't worry. If you're getting bored now, it's almost finished. All right. So uh, we're gonna do basically the same garbage right here. Okay. Um, we we have that loader, which is the, the file itself. So what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go file save. Uh, file save loader content and then exec. Oh, this is so cool now. Exec. Tickle kit, okay. Um, exec tickle kit. Holy shit, my brain. Exec tickle kit loader. <laughs> you probably got that before me. Loader ampersand. All right, and exit yourself. Okay, now. Okay, now even if I screw up and it like overwrites it with gunk, I mean we still have a backup right here, right? That was the last run, so. Life sucks. All right, so let's do this. Let's drop it in. All right, let's. Oh, actually, I didn't bind it, so I'll just type reload self here. Does it work? Oh, yes! All right, BG green. No, BG black. FG green, right? Because now we're doing matrix hacking, right? Reload self. Oh, what did I say? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You see that? That's what I'm talking about. And now, all right, watch this. I'm just going to put the binding in here. Okay. This is this is what I'm talking about. All right. Bind all. Alt F2. Reload self. Oh, yeah. Oh, look. We don't even have a cursor. Isn't that awesome? Because it's uh, background. So we're going to we're gonna fix that, too. Actually, we're not going to fix that yet. Okay. So, and now let's reload self. Reload self. Uh, yeah. And here we go. And now I can press Alt F2, right? All right, let's press it. Alt F2, reload self. Yeah, man. Yeah. But see, the thing is, if you put obvious error, if you put an error in, right? Like here, watch. I'll show you. Oh, you see, I don't have a cursor. It's awesome. Okay. Let's just change this back, all right? Because I can't see nothing. All right, let's reload that. Uh, but see, now I can test, okay? Because if you reload with an error, you're going to get some nasty stuff, all right? So let's just reload. Let's just... Alt F1 it. Okay, again, Alt F1 is to run another. All right, so here's Alt F1. Okay, it works correctly. So because it works collect cor correctly, I can actually Alt F2 and just reload self now. All right, there you go. Life's cool, right? It's awesome. And now actually I can see my cursor, which is always kind of useful. All right, you can change the color of the cursor, but it's uh, insert background color. BG. I don't care. All right, so. Uh, that's it pretty much. So look, I'm going to press Alt F2 again, and boom, you can see the windows here disappear, reappear. Oh my god, look at that. Press Alt F2 again. That's it, man. It's just, it's amazing, okay? And, and you can see, if you go back to the main program, if you look at it, you see here? It's being editing itself. Watch, okay? I'm going to order by date modified. So you see here, right? Prog.x is reloaded. 2205, 2205. Now watch. Okay, I'm going to run another. Alt F2, oops, that's run itself. Okay, whatever, 2206. Okay, so everything's cool. But what I'm trying to say now is, you don't need Notepad anymore, goodbye. So that's it, man, you're editing. You're, 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 you just built your own Emacs. <laughs> Holy crowley, okay, and because I, I don't need this anymore, because uh, I fixed that CD, so obviously some of this code can be cleaned up a little bit. Some hack job, eh? All right, enjoy.